Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> All right. Thank you. So the agricultural green roof is a very huge and essential component of this project. Without that, we literally would not have a farm. Um, the green roof was funded by a stormwater management grant by the Metropolitan Sewer District, the MSD, and I'm very pleased to have Brian Holscher, the CEO of the Metropolitan Sewer District here today to share a few words. Thank you, Mary. Um, I've got an interesting story to tell you why MSD is here. It started five years ago. MSD was in the middle of negotiating a consent decree. We knew we had $100 million of green infrastructure we needed to put in the city instead of building a $2 billion tunnel along the riverfront. How were we going to get that done? Well, we had agreed that we would do a $3 million early action project. We were meeting with folks in the city, with the mayor's staff, and talking about how to coordinate activities. We started working with some of their vacant land programs. It allowed us to purchase land, in some cases put rain gardens, those types of things, and start holding water. And out of that experience came the idea that MSD wasn't going to reach our goals of decreasing the amount of overflows by doing it on our own. We needed to partner with other folks. So we fortunately enough talked the EPA into letting us propose early action projects before the program was approved. Um, this is part of that. Uh, to date, we've issued, for 21 projects, over $17 million in grants, $135,000 here. Um, and, and that's kind of how MSD got here, but I, I want to give you kind of the personal piece of it. Um, prior to this position, two years ago, I was the Director of Engineering. And at our office over on Market in Jefferson, I'd stand on the third or fourth floor balcony and look down and see all these black roofs everywhere, knowing that was our problem. How are we going to resolve this? And, and coming out of that was talking to my staff and saying, look, I want a green roof somewhere. So we had a couple of false starts. We were even out to people asking them, please build a green roof. We want to help donate money. We want to do something. Well, apparently, all the yelling at my staff didn't work. It took Mary and all you folks to finally make my dream come true. So um, besides just thanks for this, uh, it's an example of what a partnership can be. We're taking care of our little narrow environmental issue having to do with overflows. But we, we're hitting Green Island, we're taking care of all the food issues that Mary and, and Catherine described. It's a perfect example of why partnerships are the way, I think somebody said earlier, for everybody in St. Louis for us to get things done. So um, I want to thank everybody here, and I think just in closing I would say, Mary, thank you for being the one to make my dream come true. I'll make sure Mark Kester knows you're the one responsible.